Alright everyone, right now I'm inside the living room from a very insane abandoned house that has been abandoned for a couple of years right now. It's a very strange house, literally everything's left behind, you won't believe it eyes. I'm actually speechless, I'm completely by myself, I don't know, but <laughs> look behind me. It's gonna be insane, it's all I can say. It's very close from where I live, so smash like, subscribe to my channel and let's get straight to the video. Alright everyone, it's been a while since I actually explored a, a crazy time capsule house like this. Even a brand new television is there actually, I don't know why, but look what a mess. But you clearly can see everything is left behind, actually in a very good condition, there is no vandalism at all. It's just a little bit messy here, but that doesn't matter. The best thing is that everything is left behind. Are we going to start from this area right now? I don't know exactly what the hell that is. But probably they were sitting here to watch the division or something. Whoa, even the, the box is still left behind. Look, Eden Wood. It's actually a television in 4K, so they're actually brand new. That's strange, man, to see this. It's literally here for like, I don't know, many years. <sighs> okay, people leave things like this behind. Here we have actually a desk which they probably used as an office or something to doing some paperwork or something let me know in the comments below what your opinion about this fans but look at this, it's literally insane look over there we have a furrow head that's very beautiful actually, I really like that style they had a good taste, like the brick walls then the wooden ceiling two beautiful chandeliers <laughs> isn't crazy a huge sofa over here this must be very cozy. A lot of teddy bears. <laughs> wow. Even here we have like a mini BME right here for the kids. Beautiful, isn't it? Brand new vacuum over there. Sort of box with LED lights. It's so insane. This is the first time I've been inside a house like this. And I know it's abandoned for like many many years right now. Not that long, maybe like five or three years something. Over here we have books. Even games from Nintendo DS. Yo, how crazy is this? Oh. I'm living speechless. Some more photos there on this cabinet. Even the cabinets are still filled with paperwork and stuff. Like that. There's probably a PlayStation 2 left behind here somewhere. Wow. Some sense. I can't understand why people can't leave this behind. But this is nice. We have a uh, Chucky over there. We have the one from Sao. <laughs> this is sick. I know some of you actually asked me in the comments and previous videos if I'm sometimes nervous exploring abandoned houses or anything else. Well, the answer is yes, I'm nervous, especially now when I'm actually on my own. So many things can happen. And it's definitely not recommended for you if you want to back. So you always have to be with you or maybe three just to be sure that you're safe, you know. And that nothing bad can happen. But to see this place, I'm a little speechless. I don't know what to say, man. I've never seen a house like this with so many valuable items left behind. I can't understand that how people can do this actually. They are busy with cleaning this house that they gonna empty everything or something. Because you have some boxes over here and probably yeah. They will yeah. 
take everything away from this beautiful house. And maybe soon this house will be completely empty or something. <laughs> Very sad though, but it is what it is. Another cabinet and decoration stuff. There's also even a mini bar over here. over someone over here we have the kitchen area beautiful isn't it the fridge is completely empty so you can see it's not in use anymore so many cleaning products This is way too sick. It smells bad here like cannabis or something. I don't like that. But you can see many stuff is left behind over here. I don't want to spend my time too much here. I have to go upstairs. <laughs> All right. Small storage area over here. All right, let's go to upstairs quick. Even many shoes are left behind. Unbelievable. This. Over here we have a bathroom. <gasps> right here we have a toilet. <laughs> and now we are at the first floor. The sleeping rooms. Look at this. How oh, crazy. Probably a kids room over here. There is actually a telescope left behind. What the hell? It's actually expensive and they actually left this all behind. <sighs> Even a freaking Xbox. 360. <laughs> Unbelievable guys. A desk. Some books. Very crazy. It's kind of messy here, but look at this. Probably the bedroom where actually the parents slept or something. They left all the clothes behind. Unbelievable. I literally have to come back in a few days with a friend or something. Otherwise, I'm actually nervous. I don't like to be here, but especially alone. It's actually a kick ass location, but. Like I said, it's dangerous to be alone here, you never know what can happen. So that's the reason why I will come back with a friend or something to explore in detail. It's so cool to see all the clothes left behind. They actually had a lot of clothes. Even all the sacks over here. What the hell? I think the floor is all of wood. This a mess. Wow, looks like a game room. <gasps> this is insane, literally. Dude. 
What the hell, everyone? I found this. <gasps> it's not a real one, but it's nice to see. All right, everyone, back at the main floor. I showed you actually the whole place. It's not big. It looks bigger outside than inside, but yeah, I promise you fam, so if I can, I will come back with a friend or something. So we can do this place in detail. I know there's actually a lot of stuff to see right now. And I know he probably wants to see more. I'm gonna be honest fam. Well, I will see it completely by myself. I didn't trust it for 100%. But I definitely come back one day with a friend to explore this place in detail because there's actually a lot to see. I will not wait any more longer to go back. Maybe in a couple of weeks it will completely empty or something. You never know these days. But yeah, this was sick. I really enjoyed exploring this. I literally found a gun. Probably not a real one, but it's nice. Also, the furniture is nice. Even the, the way how this Buddha's house is very beautiful actually with the brick walls and the wooden ceiling, you know, and all the high-tech stuff that's left behind like the 4k television that is right behind me even the, a vacuum you have seen by with your own eyes this is this insane i will not show you the whole side i will protect it for vandals that they're not going to recognize this house but yeah you've seen it now with your own eyes see it as a sort of um, teaser video or something and in order to do the complete video i think i actually completed the place but like I said, I didn't show the everything in detail, so I apologize and I hope you understand why I'm doing this as well. And yeah, thanks for watching fam. It's your boy Jeffrey from Just Data World. Don't forget to leave a like in case you haven't already. Don't forget to subscribe, of course, is actually the most important thing. And turn on the post notifications so you're never gonna miss anything new in the future. Alright, I'm gonna take some pictures right now before I'm gonna leave this place. And again, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you right now and on the epic explore peace